Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and today we have the video Some of my Hot Wheels Part 2. I saw that Part 1 had a lot of success so why not I, w I wanted to make a Part 2. So here we go. Car number 1 is this brand new casting the 1942 Willys MB Jeep drag car with a stretched front wheelbase and that looks pretty weird for some of you people but for normal dragsters like some of the Hot Wheels models got that too so and some dragsters got that too so yes it's actually kind of normal for a dragster uh, you see that it got a beautiful color. It's blue with red and yellow striping here. And the white interior and tires and rims, I mean rims, only rims, just makes it perfect. Here you see the parachute and the huge V8 engine. And here the black exhaust pipes. Um... If you tell if you ask me this is a very cool casting. Let's go to the next one and that's a new casting too. It's the Hudson Hornet. And this car is a pretty iconic racer. And uh I love it myself. Uh when I started to watch cars, I saw this car in the movie and I thought, wow. That looks very cool. And now Hot Wheels made it uh, with a new paint job, number 817. Uh, here's the Hudson Hornet. And I love the paint job. I love the colors and all on it, the rims. It's just a beautiful casting. Let's go to the next one. A recolor from the Greenwood corvette it is a group 5 race car out of the 70s this one is out of 1976 exactly and i got the gold one too but this one is my favorite because it's just light blue with the orange yellow and black and it just a beautiful color and it just um a uh, really nice form is really aerodynamic huge headlights and here you see the exhaust pipes coming out on the right and left side of the car let's go to the next one it's the speed core dodge charger out of the 70s let's see the exact uh, year 69 i'm sorry the 60s um and this one is one of the brutest dodges I ever had, uh, I ever had, or that I have, because I got the Demon Two. Uh, I can get that one. Here it is. It's the Demon, and uh, yes, uh, it's a Challenger and a Charger. Uh, the Demon looks more modern because it's more modern out of twenty eighteen. But if you look at the black charger out of 69 it got just the pure muscle car contrast that literally every muscle car has like this pontiac gto the judge in bordeaux red they look kind of the same at the form let's go to the next one it's the twin mill gen e some of you may say that it suck but I like it because this car is the future of the twin mill that was produced in the, uh, I don't know, even in the 70s or something. It was a red liner. It is original. Uh, but here you see, this is the light blue one. And the thing is, it got no huge engines here. And no uh, straight pipes here. or But it got the form of the twin mill. And I like the twin mill. And this one is my favorite generation of the twin mill. Let's go to the next one. This one is out of a five pack. 
It's the Lamborghini Gallardo LP500 or 574 in lime green. I love this color on this car. It is actually a real color. There is a uh, Gallardo with this color. Uh, and here you see this black stripe. It says uh, Super Leggera. Super Leggera. Uh, because it's a lightweight one uh, with a spoiler, uh, bigger diffuser, bigger uh, front splitter. Uh, and I say this is my favorite Gallardo out of my collection. That's why I picked it. Let's go to the next one. And this is a hypercar, the McLaren P1 in uh, green. Yes, I think it's green. It is green, but then a bit of, uh, more candy green uh, with gray wheels and black striping. Um, it looks very nice. Uh, it got that uh, hypercar look. It got the styling and all. The color is really original. I love that. It's fully detailed because here you can see the exhaust pipe, the tail lights and the headlights. And the stripe just, yeah, I like it. I can't say that I really love it, but it still looks kind of cool. Let's go to the next one. It's the orange Jaguar XE Project uh, 7. No, wait, Project 8. And this Jaguar flies over the Nuremberg ring with its carbon top. It's not real carbon, but it's like made like carbon. And all the cool things on it like this uh, diffuser here, uh, spoilers and splitters. Um, so this is a race version of the XE in in orange and that is why i love this car orange is my favorite color and this car looks amazing in this orange here you see the detailing on the car that it just the colors here uh that black uh, points or something that it just perfectly is made for this car let's go to the next one and it's the purple muscle bound and this car this car is the perfect hot wheels muscle car here you see the huge v8 engine is under this um it got that brutal muscle car look the only thing that i don't really like is that there are two exhaust pipes on one side uh, i think real muscle cars got here an exhaust pipe and here an exhaust pipe uh, but uh, further, it is from Speedblur, so you got these uh, silver, or uh, yeah, silver tires, tires, yes, tires. Um, I want to say rims, but it's tires. Uh, and just yes, there, uh, the rims are silver too. Uh, but yes, it looks really cool with this amazing paint job that is specially made with Speedblur. It got that same sort of color like the mclaren like that candy purple let's go to the next one and that is one out of a five pack two uh it's a lotus esprit s1 out of the 70s uh, yes 70s i think uh with that uh like candy or metallic metallic uh yellow color and this one is really fast on the track because the wheels are really um good uh, they are really good made uh so uh, when it's fresh out of the five pack it really rolls on the track it's one of my quickest hot wheels cars and it's one of my favorite hot wheels cars because it looks so stylish it just one line it just made with one line and the color is beautiful and the rims too let's go to the next one it's a 2020 a case or 2019 car it's a jaguar xj220 and this car is one of the uh, no 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 it's 
There are only two Jaguar hypercars, the CX-75 and this XJ220. This XJ220 is actually the XJ X CX-75, but then a few years ago. Uh, this car, it's orange too, it's just the perfect color with the Jaguar racing uh, stripes and kits and all. Um, it looks really nice. And a cool fact is, uh, actually a pretty uncool fact, is that here you see the engine, it's a V6. Because in the concept of the XJ220, they wanted to give it a V12. But the car is it's just the space that wasn't big enough. So they couldn't get a V12, they made a V6. That is pretty... Uh, I don't know how to say that, but I don't like it. Uh, let's go to the next one. It's the Chevy Nova Wagon Gasser. And yes, the gasses. Hot Wheels makes the gasses just with really cool paint jobs. Uh, they give them huge engines and really fat and uh, racing and cool racing tires. Um, so this one is a recolor the secondary color of the Nova Wagon. Here you see that it got the uh, 1980s or 90s Hot Wheels logo and that is one of my favorite details. It says Jerry Rigged, I don't know what that means but it looks really cool on it. Uh, and here we've got that huge V8 engine and the exhaust pipes coming out of the chassis let's go to the next one and the final one with a really powerful 600 horsepower engine here comes the 2 jet z this is a uh, tiny car now nah, it looks pretty tiny with 600 horsepower and a 2 gz engine because it's called 2 jet z so i think that it got a 2 gz engine uh so it looks really cool. It's really rough. Um, it's just pure metal body here. And it got that huge engine here. And the exhaust pipe coming out of the engine just right straight uh, between the spoilers here. Uh, here you see the uh, wheels are just popped out of the chassis. And the bodywork is just so original that I just like it. This is the first color, the second color. I don't have that one, but I like it really much in blue. Uh, so, these were all of the part two video cars. And don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.